And now, welcome back to Antique Roadshow on the road. Um, we're here in Virginia, and we have Joe Schmo with us. Welcome, Joe. Um, Joe, tell us. Sorry, um, tell us again what you have with you. Well, uh, my grandfather was an avid art collector, yeah. and um, yes, and um, before he allegedly uh, died, he, um, me and my grandmother uh, pulled these out from uh, his old junk. Incredible, incredible. So, and um, yeah, found these. Francis Bordeaux, if this signature is correct. Now, if authentic, these are, are truly pieces of history. Francis Bordeaux was uh, uh, a notorious World War II painter, uh, captured these grisly depictions by painting while on the battlefield. Bullets whizzing over his head. Really, really fuels the, the hyper-realistic and, and tense style that he created. Anything to say? Um, I would have to ask about the, what is this dialogue that I see here? That doesn't seem to be of the time. Well, uh, honestly, the dialogue is probably more accurate by Francis Bordeaux than by most history books. All right, um, so I guess I'm just wondering, is that, that, that looks like a dolphin holding a bazooka. Well, know. yes, so funny that you asked that. Francis Bordeaux took certain creative liberties in order to, to... Took certain creative liberties in order to depict the enemies and the, the Germans and the Nazis in such a way that uh, added some, some humor and, and boosted morale for the people back home and the people in his uh, troop. And, uh, yeah, he was truly a hero for that in a different battlefield. Can we, uh... Here, sorry, Joe Schmo. Oh, uh, yeah. This, this is really great stuff, but we Thank just you. have to... Uh, Thank you. Here, just, here, Unfortunately, just. I, I don't think that I could ever purchase these. I truly believe they belong in a museum. But, oh, really? Uh, wow. yeah. We'll get back to you. What did you need? Okay, um... You do realize yeah, yeah. that I these understand. are just Sharpie drawings. They yeah, are yeah. Sharpie drawings. So I understand, I understand. Some 82-year-old PTSD dream, whatever. The ratings are in the toilet, okay? No one watches Antique Roadshow anymore. We need this. We need to discover some long-lost art and history. Yeah, just sell it with me, okay? We need this. All right, I'm gonna trust you on this one, okay? This could be big for us, okay? Well, Mr. Schmo, uh, in my expert opinion, I don't think that such a unique piece of art and history can be given a dollar amount. Truly, it belongs in a museum. But if, for the sake of uh, our TV show, it needed to be given a dollar rating, maybe invented a number to describe how valuable this is, I'd say one bajiglion. Huh? <laughs> It's truly been a pleasure to see you here on the show, yeah, Joe yeah. Schmo. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Joe Schmo, for oh. being on the show. Well, I hope really you have a, a shake my hand. Shake my hand. We really appreciate um, it. Actually, good, good luck with uh, auctioning yeah. that. I, I hope it. Yeah, it yeah. is a beauty. Well. It is a beauty. Yeah, actually, I do have one more. Um, really? really, another yeah. Francis oh, Bordeaux. Ooh. Yeah, we found Ooh. this buried under the others. Ladies and um, gentlemen, three Francis Bordeaux yeah. on Antiques Roadshow. We were just wondering if it was worth anything. Oh. Mm. Well. Can't can't uh, win every time. I'm, I'm afraid this one is a counterfeit. Oh, it's can I? Very nice. <laughs> this is a masterpiece. I think it will fetch you, ladies and gentlemen. Cents. This mm. is art. <laughs> it it has its own value, but not as a Francis Bordeaux piece. Mm. I'm sorry. Shame. But uh, I'll I'll just take that back. Thanks. Uh, yeah, of course, yeah. of course. Yeah. Wait, wait, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> If you've seen this man with this painting, please call your local authorities. Oh, you know, man. It was really cool your uncle to let us stay here for the night. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a real cool guy, dude. Yeah. 
You know, I should really before we you know hit the sack, we should I should thank him for the. Well, no, no, you, it's I mean it's okay. Like he's he's gonna be doing his thing. He's, he said it's okay, so just uh. I I feel like I really should. No, 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 he he's out in the pool. You don't want to disturb him. When he's out in the pool. That's like what is it like midnight and he's out in the pool? Yeah, that's what he does most nights. He just kind of floats around the pool, it's like his thing. He likes to do it. Like all night. Yeah, most of the day too. <laughs> Just floats in the pool. And, like, all day, every day? I mean, I'm not here all day to, to know, but just about all the time I see him, he's out there. It's... How long has he been doing that? Oh, huh. 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 A while. Alright. Good night. Uh, hey. You mind if I uh, play some ambient sounds while I sleep? Helps me, helps me get good sleep quality. Oh yeah, you're good, dude. You're good. <sighs> Alright, cool. Good night, man. Yeah, good night. What's up, bro? Bro, you... I'm sorry. Are those your ambient sounds that I'm hearing? Oh, shoot. Yeah, man. What's what's up? Um, it, it... It sounds like the opening scene of Saving Private Ryan. Yeah. yeah. So, I just I just like to have someone to remind me of home, you know? A little someone to put me in a nice, peaceful environment. Something familiar. Is that cool with you? Well, I've got lots of I, options. You want I, something else? You, you want something yeah, else? Yeah, please, please. If we could do like some <laughs> animal sounds or something, please, that'd be much okay, better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Did I did I hit you? Uh, just a little bit. Yeah. Don't wake me up, bro. I'm sorry. It's another rule about this moment. Like, don't wake me up. Okay. Okay. All right. How's this? Man, that sounds like a dog digging through the trash. No, 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 no. Wait, I want, you never had a dog when you were growing up. But that's not. Hmm. 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 It's just can we just do like sounds? Like, I just, sound, I just sounds like, like. Can we do like some jungle sounds? You know, stuff like that. I whatever. I ain't never lived in the jungle, but like I guess that's okay. ambient. So okay, here. How's this? That's good. That's good. Let's just let's hit the sack. Right, right. We got an early morning tomorrow. Good night, good night. Don't wake me up. Okay. <laughs> In the world, they always see the, the place hunting oh, four or five hundred feet into the sky. It is, it's a terrific crash, ladies and gentlemen. The smoke and the flames now, and the frame is crashing to the ground, not quite to the morning mass of the humanity. I've had it with that, bro. I, 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 I no. Ah, ah. Bajiglian? Our numbers are in the red, people!